So hello everyone, hello. and we are here now live. Um, we just uh, did a whole hour plus time on the design uh, or the Q&A for an hour long with that. And today what we are going to do, this is our last uh, live together currently in the Czech Republic. So what we are going to do is we are going to do... Step up the game. We are stepping up the game and Victory. we have... Beat off. We are doing a beat off. I called it the great beat off actually is what I'm calling it for. Um, so if you are looking, the basically name of this game is that we are having a design challenge. So <laughs> we are, if you look at the top, we have today's design palette that we have disc duos. Then we're going to go for 10 minutes with crystals and seed beads, leaf duos, Eva beads, storm duos, and then the viewer's choice. So this is where you guys come into play is that um, for number six, you can, we have uh, somebody that's going to kind of compile everything. Nathan's going to compile everything. So for the viewer's choice, comment and let us know exactly which beads you want us to use. At the end hopefully of our- I have them here. <laughs> hopefully we have them and we will find them quickly, gather them up and use them. So the name of the game is that we are doing this lightning round design challenge. You can see right above my head, the little clock. And the clock is going to let us know how much time we have left to design with these beads. First bead up is going to be the disc duo. To make it a little bit more challenging, at the end of each bead, at the end of those 10 minutes, before the next clock starts over, you're going to let us know who won. So the first thing you need to know and see is that we have... I have here some nice kind of fleshy colored nails and I am using black thread. So that's Ali's side is that it's yeah. kind of opposite of what you think. And that, I am dark. And so Teresa has green, green so thread. Green thread. So yeah. Teresa has green thread. I have black thread. So you'll be able to kind of keep us in the corners. It's actually kind of funny. Two, you can't really see. Are mine. <laughs> yeah. You can't really see the corners, but we have, it's almost like a boxing match where we have our needles kind of gathered in the corners that we're like ready to go. Get my gear on. I need like a water bottle here ready to go <laughs> ready ready hello, to face everyone. off hello joining everyone thanks for joining us and staying with us and we are like i said going to get into this design challenge so we have the clock going we have three minutes uh remaining we're going to go ahead and get started into the designing process so I tracy gets what i'm going to do i don't like... know what i'm doing either so tracy while i'm getting the yeah. clock ready you pour out yeah, some seed beads. Some seed beads. so a lot of designing starts out with I will put some here. Some that's a good, here. that's nice yeah, that's of you. Yeah, that's a good idea. That's right. nice of you. So we have 11s, we have 15s. Prepare the clock, prepare the clock. Yeah, I'm doing so, so well, I'm going to let the clock go, I think, now. Oh, right. Now that I thought about it. I'll make you your pile. We'll do, we'll do fair fighting challenges okay. here. So we have, and then we have our bead in the middle. We'll do the same thing, too, that we did Ooh. yesterday. Um, and we ran out of time, actually, to pick somebody that, if you are commenting and you are watching and... Um, want to give us a comment, uh, let us know exactly what bead you want for your viewer's choice. Um, that will be helpful and we'll give you all the contents of our bead mat so we don't have to clean it up. I yeah. had the other one sitting around here somewhere. We still need to pick somebody, so we'll pick somebody from our last um, design challenge. And I feel like we should wear like in the green corner and in the blue corner. Like in the blue corner I, facing I have, off. I have blue t-shirt and like dark blue nails. So I'm fine. Yeah, you are fine. So you should I'm, have green nails. I should have green nails. I know. I can't do it. I can't do it. I need to catch, catch the uh, fun flare. So we have two minutes. I'm going to start us though. So we have, just to let you know, we have 15s, 11s, 8s, and then we have our disc duos kind of piled in the middle. Yep. Now, you can also determine um, if you want us to pull another bead into the design. Oh, I'm throwing that challenge in. So if you want us to, you can be like the, uh, the what do we call it, the kitchen last time. If you want us to, if enough of you, if three people say to use a certain bead um, in addition to the design, and we have it sitting here, let's pull that in. So at the oh five my. minute, at the five minute point, <laughs> the first person, I know, <laughs> the five minute point, somebody can throw out a new bead for us to throw into our design. But it needs to be here, so. <laughs> it, needs, it needs to be here, so we'll say yay or nay, but 
That way, it kind of throws an extra challenge into us. We'll do it first with the distuos, and we'll see how terrible, <laughs> how terrible it is, and then we'll go, we'll go from there and see if we can do this challenge. All right, I'm going to restart uh, this clock here, and restarting the clock is going to give um, us an actual start time. So, ready? We are five, four, three, two, one. All right, Teresa, what are you going to do? I don't know. I don't know either. Okay. We've got nine minutes and 56 seconds. So uh, somebody yesterday said <laughs> how nauseous they were getting yeah. or dizzy <laughs> because the four hands on the board and coming from yeah. all different directions. So the first thing I'm going to do is a stop bead. And I don't have yeah. one in a different color, so I'm going to do yeah. a stop bead. You already have beads on? Oh, man. So <laughs> Teresa already the, has beads. I started the big with the arrows. I never do that, but like, I, I don't know. Think. So I'm, I'm too not going to start originally with my disc duo. I'm going to start with three 11s and see where I go. So I have my three 11s. And the disc duo, we have apricot 11s. We have um, Duracoat galvanized gold 15s. We have dark topaz A, B, silver lined in the 8s. And then um, we have the uh, uh, golden uh, touch sand sky. Sandalwood? Sky. No, sandalwood sky. Sand oh, is the like, grayish one. Oh, okay. So I, I didn't get any needles set up here with just um, That's with fine. Two, two needles. So That's fine. I literally have no idea what I'm doing. I'm just doing a count of four right now. Yeah, me too. But I'm, I'm, I'm not there yet. So we have uh, three minutes before somebody tells us another bead to throw in here, too. So if you want to tell us another bead to throw in, that's kind of fun. So this actually really is, um, hopefully you guys are enjoying this because this is a lot of fun. Super Duo. I like the Super Duo vote because I actually haven't used Super Duos in a while. Yeah. So we probably will have to have, although I have no Super Duos sitting near me. So we might have to I gather them those. I have them on my earrings. So we'll just cut your earrings apart no. and take them. <laughs> yeah, use the super duos. So, I don't know. Do I want to round mine out? Do I want to keep it? Ooh, I am I rounding know. it down. Like, you are rounding yeah. it out? But it's fine. Uh, then I won't round it out. I'll vary it up. I'll see what I get going here. This is hard. This is like colors I don't... I ever put... Like, together? Know, yeah. I wouldn't normally put these together either. These are literally just what... Yeah, so. Well, the sea beads look pretty together, but... Um, it's not my first choice with the sky. So it kind of adds a whole nother. You said you like blue and the cool I do. Things. I do. Well, the blue and the apricot together look gorgeous. I would do that. Yeah. The, actually, I would probably put it. Yeah, I would put all these colors together. I'm lying. I said I wouldn't, but I would. Mm, what was I going to do? What was I going to do? Put two of these in here. Round this out. So I'm not really sure. The fun thing of this is we literally have no idea where what um ahead of time we don't cheat yeah we try to stay faithful to this challenge like and seed beads and just one shape that's hard it is without it's joining like, it, yeah i can do peyote i can do flat stitch oh, peyote like but like that's no that's no challenge it's I like repeating I itself i should have repeated these no. as, I got them, <laughs> as i got them started so now looking back i wish i would have done this little trim that i'm doing i should have done that from the start with all my disc duos. So I'll have to go back yeah, and add that. And I should have like go over. I'll add it though. What do we have left? Okay, we're still good. Yeah. We're yeah. still and and I'm feeling pretty You're actually not inspired. The comments. Um I know we're trying to see Rivoli's. Mm. Oh, that's a good one. I have posted my wish for number six. Cool, cool, cool. It's both so, the duos. Oh yeah. beads oh beads are good. Oh SOs. Yeah. Super duos. We've got I don't have SOs here. Two millimeter Potomac crystal rounds. So we'll use the crystal rounds while we um, when we get to the crystals. Yeah, so they're here. They're like right behind you. <laughs> All right. So this is what mine's turning into so far. Oh, you're using you're we're gonna see what we're doing. Yep, I'm and making see, the something. Funny, like <laughs> I really think at some point we should like blindfold yeah, um, each other. Each other and see what... But we don't have to do it because like in six hours you will be away and then... I know, we can't <laughs> see really. Because yeah. it's going to be really hard to... I can look over and see what you're doing. Yeah. But to look up on the computer screen. So we're trying to uh, basically... Um, we're going to be investigating some software to be able to do this from opposite corners yeah, then of you the lose, world. Then you lose sound. And, and then I you lose, lose sound. sound. We lose sound. We're going to have all kinds of technical yeah, issues yeah, yeah. to work out. I'm more likely to mess up with sound things. 
We're still really not sure what happened. We changed the battery in the phone, yeah, which I the guess, or in the uh, camera, which I guess I didn't like, and that's kind of what happened with the actual sound previously. So I'm kind of bummed because I really should have done this at the start as well, but I'm liking it. I don't know, and I think mm -hmm. I'm gonna, so yeah. my idea is to connect yeah. another yeah. disc duo mm -hmm. and do something there. So you can see mm -hmm. kind of our, our creative minds. I like the minds. color. I like rarely use the golden touch. In them. I know, I, and the golden touch is pretty. Maybe I should. It's maybe that I should. added extra. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Five minutes. Five minutes remaining. And let's see. So, see, I'm not paying attention as much to the comments. Monkey, I know. Space Paisley Duo, duos. Oh, we've got Trio. we've got lots of stuff going on here. I'm in for the win. I'm really competitive. I'm like super competitive. <laughs> Yesterday I felt a little defeated. I'm only competitive in certain things in life, things that matter, like beating competitions. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I am I am a super competitive person. So if you're a competitive person, you can root for my side of the team here. And go I'm and competitive go. too. We can we can I know, game this with is... my husband because I always lose in some in some games and. I just can't talk to him for some time, and I, I, it doesn't help the mood life. <laughs> we uh, we do we no longer do family game night. Uh, we need to. I need to teach my children that board games do not affect the rest of the weekend. So they're at the age right now where it crushes everybody, and no one yeah. wants to talk to each other. And the little ones have I no idea so what's going on. Oh. I actually didn't, okay, I didn't think about this, but now I'm thinking about it as a necklace. Yeah, yeah, like yeah. the bracelets. Yeah, I don't know, I'll keep going. So you can see, because I didn't add it right away, how it's turning, and this is as Teresa would not like to think of it. Um, <laughs> it needs two beads on the, as yeah. the connector, which is why it's turning, but I could do this as two needles, and it wouldn't turn as much. So let's see here. Anybody have any suggestions for me? Should I keep going with it one-sided or should I add it back to the other side? I'm not sure if I add it back, if I keep it connected. Uh, you need some, too bad. I do need some crystals in here. So I might have to, <laughs> I might have to swap in some crystals in here. So. Do you have them here or should I just no, reach I've, out? No, I've got some, some crystals here. But I still don't know. I might add it to the other side too. I don't know. I'm torn. Do I add it I to the other side? With the, like, what are you doing over there? I don't know what you're doing. Like, oh, you're getting complicated. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I have a design like that that went complicated, <laughs> and I, it's two-sided. We get to the point where I can't think of the name. So I'm going to let that last one of my... So the distro is so far, I'm kind of like, I, I want to keep going. We only have two minutes left. So we might have to come back to some of these. Conceptually, um, nobody can see what either of us are doing right yeah. now. So it's going to be a hard vote because we're both kind of working on figuring out what we're doing. I feel pressured. I feel pressured to like string my needle, <laughs> do my beads faster. So, so, so. <laughs> so. That's right. a hard word for me to say. So. So. And, and, yeah, and then, a and needle they, pulling thread. That's yeah. what we can say. What? You can start. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. A needle pulling thread. You know, wow. like, yeah. Get a little parent or a little uh, Disney facts in there for mm. you and stuff and songs. Wow. Doe a deer. Female deer. Oh my goodness! You really you have not seen uh, Bambi. No, not well, Bambi. Not. Which no, no, one? no. Um, I'm drawing a bank because I'm concentrating on beating. Um, <laughs> Teresa has never seen uh, uh, in uh, Austria. There's said in Austria, she's a nun. She goes to take care of the family of five children, six children, Mary seven Poppins? children. No. no, not Mary. She is Mary Poppins, though. Uh, why can't I think of this? Help me out, people. Come on. Oh, no, Sound of Music, thank you. You've never seen a Sound of Music? No. Oh, my goodness. Okay. We are going to stop our beating challenge and go watch the Sound of Music because Teresa has never seen the Sound of Music. No. She is Mary Poppins. She also takes care of children. I've, all of the movies. I've, I've never seen Mary Poppins. You've never seen Mary Poppins either? Oh gosh, no. Of all the good American movies, you, like, you're, like, missing some. I, I remember there, like... There was a cartoon and I loved it and so when I was a kid and it was, I think it was American. It was like, it's not the actual, you know, actual name, but there was a, like a <clears throat> mouse and she had a son and he was sick and she had to go somewhere. Oh, and I have Miss, no idea what Mrs. you're talking about. Pris, Mrs. Prisby was her name and I 
I'm older secret than you. of name or something like that? I'm older than you, so I don't know. No, this is this is old. old. Yeah. No. Yeah. All I'm thinking is Tom and Jerry. But no, no, no the no, fact no. that you have never seen Mary Poppins, now we're way off topic with 27 seconds left. Um, somebody please buy Teresa Mary Poppins and send it to her so she can watch Mary Poppins and lo learn how to say so. And all of your... Uh, and all of your musical notes? Oh, come on. All right. It's like one of my favorites. I can no. I, I couldn't watched, say the name of it. I, I watched a little more. Oh, we only have five seconds. We're gonna have to do like needles down. I'm gonna give us a grace what? period of an extra three seconds yeah. since we got way off topic. Because yeah. literally just giving the grace period because I wanna finish mine because I, I want, want I want the win. <laughs> I want the win on this, so I nah. um, instead of saying like needles down, isn't that what they say? Like <laughs> <laughs> utensils down. Yeah. I want the uh, I want to keep going with this because this I can usually tell right when I start something if I'm like ooh this can turn into a video I really like the look of this. Um, I will really I'm not need sure to what play a lot of this to turn it into a video. <laughs> ah, I've got an extra beat. Oh, I'm gonna kill Denise. I'm gonna <laughs> I'm gonna break it off. Denise, I don't know. look away. Do look away. Don't cringe. Oh. Don't kill me. I didn't kill you. Wow, that was I loud. did. I know. I clipped that, it, was that off. All right, so yeah, so my design here, I'm going to talk about the idea behind it. I'm going to put in my design that I do for the finale. I should put um, it down. <laughs> put it down. All right, my design, I want to put an extra disc duo in there, which means I need a little bit more space. And more space, as somebody said, two by three millimeter. I'm going to stick two by three millimeter crystals in the middle instead of two seed beads. Ba -ba -da -ba -da. Yeah. I'm like... I have a Oh, base. we forgot at five. We forgot at five minutes to add another. Design. I didn't. I didn't. I was just silent. Oh, you. She. I was stuck <laughs> on the sound of music. She completely ignored you. So, but I'm gonna say yes. I fictitiously added in two by three millimeter crystals. Yeah, so. so now you have the. Um, now you get to vote. So I like the concept. You're thinking out of the box, but. All right, so I'm gonna put my hands here. So I'm going to be number, so we'll say right or left, or should we say um, black or gray, green? We could do colors. What should we do as look, our voting? Look at what the screen, it? you can't tell which is green. Oh, uh, true, you can't tell which yeah. is green. So we'll go with right and left. So Teresa's is on the right, mine is on the left, and we'll keep track of, okay. of uh, you uh, keep track of our wins and who not. So, oh, I think I got this one. Ooh, woo, they're not even saying right, they're actually using my full yeah, name. Yeah, yeah, use a, like, You can use the names too. Oh. So, okay, <laughs> so that was our first one. So if you're just joining us and you're like, what is going on? They're talking about Sun of Music and you're going on left and right. So we're even right now. So I think people are just, <laughs> I think people are gonna stay even but, because they don't wanna be mean was, to either I think of us. I was left yesterday and you just said I'm right today, so like. Well, you're on so, the... So, this is Oh, Ellie. you're... No, you would be... Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, so let's yeah. say it better. So, this, this is, is mine. This is Ellie. Mine, and this is... This is, this yeah. is Ellie. So, this mine is... This is <laughs> Yeah. So, we're on those. So, we'll get that right. Sorry, right, left, right, left. I don't know. Um, <laughs> so, if you're just joining us, we are doing a design live challenge. We're going to go big now. This was our first design, so keep an eye on it. Remind it. We're going to go big for a second here. Yeah. Um, that we had... Uh, when you're looking at them, we played around with disc duos first. So our first challenge was disc duos. Trace is getting ready to burn her thread off to get ready for our design you're challenge talking. number I'm two. <laughs> I'm not burning my thread off. I actually really like my design. This is my most successful, I think, of, of it. And I said something about the colors earlier, but that's totally what I would use. <laughs> so we're going to put the disc duos back. I used a lot of Eidos, Ooh, so I need look, more Eidos on my map. Oh, what but are we doing? Uh, next is crystals seed and seed beads. Yeah. Oh. So I have a bag of random crystals here. There. Before we start the clock here. And it is a draw. And it's a draw. Thank you, All right. So before we start here, I, we can pick. We need some, like later on, we need some moderators. Those would you mind new moderators? Keep track of everything us, because yeah. the boys are now working on the app and they left us. Yeah, yeah. So usually they're pretty good about throwing things at us, so we might have to get up and move. All right. Um, so what are we going to use? I don't. I, don't I want know. this. I want this. You want the. Yeah. Okay. So you go. I'll go traditional then. I'll but go. I have the, no, like, I have intention in my mind, but there's no way I'm going to. You know, like make it in oh, 10 yeah, minutes. Oh yeah, you can't make it in 10 minutes, but you can start to yeah. try. Well, let, actually, let's do the same thing. Let's, okay. do, let's go both with Nevats. Yeah. So, 
We're going to go with navets, but you know what? I've got some of these on the sides. Okay. So let's throw in some baguettes and navets. Get ourselves hungry. We'll get a little baguettes in here. <laughs> All right. So I'm going to start the, the timer. And we are going to start again with our new design. We are doing crystals and seed beans. And as we come back to the crystals and the seed beans, five, four, three, two, one. Starting again here and getting ready with our crystals and seed beads. All right. I'm, this is tough. <laughs> I know. I'm not there yet. Um, and we forgot to, like we said, to add those in. Remember, keep in mind that if you are looking and voting, um, make sure to tell us what you want as your viewer's choice. We've had some... Uh, things that you can do. We've had Super Duo suggestions. We've had ESO suggestions. We've had um, different, uh, what were the other suggestions? We have crystals, uh, Rivoli's, Paisley. Paisley Duo. Yeah, the Paisley Duo is a hard one. Um, so keep in mind that uh, the examples that we are using are listed above you, and you can check that out and go from there. I have, I'm talking, and I have no idea what I'm going to do. But I'm going to go on with that same... I hardly ever use 8-0 OC beads. Darn it, I didn't do a stop bead at the bottom. <laughs> I hate when I do that. So It's fine, I'm just... I'm going to do a stop bead down here. And starting out here, I have an idea in mind now. I'm going to use I'm going to use my idea from I my had other but one. I can't like figure out it so quickly. <laughs> I know. I'm I'm starting to think that I might actually throw in my last design. It's well, cheating. Well, is it cheating? I don't know. Yeah. It's forming a base with that. No. Mm, that could that could work. Okay, I'm not going to cheat, but I actually really like the idea of that. Mm -hmm. I actually like the colors too. Mm -hmm. They wouldn't be colors that I would normally pick, yeah, but I like the colors together. of that. So half tilas. I want half tilas for this. Go ahead. You get up and get your half tilas, and I don't have any half tilas anymore. I want half. -tilas. So I'm going to go back to my crystal. I'm going to use that idea. So Trace is even leaving, so she. Somebody said it was a draw, but I think she won, or that I won, and she's leaving with sadness of defeat. But that's okay because she doesn't have to sit for three hours later on a bus. So you win for the day. You don't have to travel. Well, All right. Some, give me some suggestions people <laughs> Oh, yeah. While you're up, half, you half tealas. Yeah, half tealas, silkies. Um, and we'll go with that. So I'm going to go back to my idea with kind of those separators. And my idea is that I'm going to create a bezel, a netted bezel that's going to hook into the right angle weave somehow. And because I didn't measure, so sometimes with crystals and rivolis, I will actually measure. Um, Teresa, you have already used over two minutes of your time getting up and not ah! working. <laughs> but See, look. now she feels pressure. I feel pressure. I feel bad. You didn't even have to like... Uh, hit anyone on the way to the fridge, like trying to find your ingredients. <laughs> Who's got the milk? I need the milk. For those of you just joining in, Teresa has never seen The Sound of Music. <laughs> that was, that's still my, I am, my mind, blo my mind is blown. That's, and people pay other people to watch them carve pumpkins for four hours. I watched that. I know. My, uh, my mind is blown by digital things. So going in here, I am picking up a series of five in 11 O's, and then I'm doing a little uh, right angle kind of pico trim. And I'm, gonna, I'm making a netting, but even though I still want to use my other, my past design, I'm not going to cheat, but I kind of am because it's... I'm kind of creating the back of the netting so I can use so them I, together. So I got up and, and you are using two designs in one. I am two designs. I'm, I'm cheating and using two designs in one. I feel like the added challenge of these yeah. Facebook Lives so is that my plan is you pretty much like, just see our foreheads yeah. as we're doing this. Yes. Yeah. So. Okay. I have a pretty forehead, I guess. It's covered right. by the bangs. So how is it called? The piece of... I yeah, bangs. 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 Wow. Yeah, you got it. This is like the word I can I can never keep my bangs straight, so I always look like my hair is like taking off in the wind, so I don't have yeah. bangs ever. <laughs> they look nice. All right. Um, the problem with this crystal that we picked is it's big. Yeah. <laughs> so like, it's just I don't taking know that we're going to get here. Five minutes to pick up the beads for Ooh, it. Oh, I like that. Oh, I really like that. Teresa, I think, has a... She took the time to get up and get something. I thought about it. And I know. And I kind of think that uh, 
I'm a little scared for the results of this one. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure I will be able to thread all the beads at the same time. So Does she have time? So you're oh, fine. you have half tillas, or quarter tillas, too. Yeah. Oh, that you're doing. The quarter tillas at the top. That's yeah. going to look pretty. I like that. And actually, I would not have picked that pink color to go with the crystal. But when you put it up next to it, it looks really pretty. Yep. All right. I think I do not have enough yet. I'm like, I know that there's two different sides of like half tilas, but oh, that now I don't I know, have really, the time. Really, even when I design, no matter what, um, and you guys can comment and say whether or not you pay attention. I do not, and I'm interested to see people's comments. Uh, I do not... Uh, how oh, did you decide not to do sutash? You should have done sutash. That's because that's it the, takes so long. Like yeah. in ten minutes, I, I can like I can yeah. bezel one round and yeah. And we might do. It. We might. We'll see how long we can we can last on this live without getting locked out. Yeah, like discussing the possibility that, that Ellie will just take the same bead like I will, and I will do sutash, and she will do beading. But yeah, that we would do seed beads. I would work with seed beads, and she would work with sutash. Yeah, or we could, actually, we could do a wire and sutash off. Yeah. That would be fun. But it would be a long day. Yeah, so. but I, mean, I can do wire probably, I can do wire so much quicker than you can do sutash, though. Yeah. Because wire working, although to do wire working nice, you do have to take your time. But yeah. But that would be a fun not using seed beads. We could do wire and sutash with extra beads. We have all kinds of design ideas. But really, how many of you... Oh, no, I made it too big. Um, how many of you actually no, use the... Beads. I, made, I made mine too big. How many of you actually ah. use and see the side of the tila? I'm, I do not uh, particularly care to actually... Uh, find the side of the tila and work with it. When you're doing um, that really popular one, that's the, uh, mm, mm, we're just talking about it, the patchwork or uh, the quilted tila, where it goes like every other in the seed beads and the herringbone stitch yeah, yeah, yeah. pattern. That one, it is kind of nice if you do get an end to your tila. So it's meant to go oh, around. <laughs> Mine's going around too. I'm also bezel setting. But I'm bezel setting with netting. So Trace is doing bezel set. So you just need... You can get that around. It's going to be a challenge, but... All right. I have an even amount. Oh, crap. I have an odd amount. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. I want an even amount. So I would rework this, and my reworking would involve... I have, like, extra beads. This the issue. <laughs> you could just break them off. I'll hand you the pliers. You want to break them off. Um, so mine would involve taking a seed bead probably away from the netting. I'm yeah. going to work with it. But with the um, with the look of the crystal. I so lost this one. <laughs> no, I I actually really like the concept of yours, though. I like that half tila um, idea and even that quarter tila. Problem with mine is I don't have time really to do the netting. Yeah. Um, we have two minutes. I'm, I'm working with it. I'm trying to speed bead. I'm sorry, guys. I put this, this is speed, up to speed my bead. face because I have to see. I know that lesson of never put anything up to your face. Yeah. Oh, I need less beads. Uh. <laughs> All right. I have less beads. I'm going with that 11.0. And let's see. I don't think that's going to be tight enough. No, I need less beads. Basically, what I'm trying to do is form these in so I can do a netting. And I'm going to need less beads for it. Um, all right, coming in here towards the home stretch. Neither of us are anywhere. We picked crystals that are too big. Yeah. That's our problem. They're beautiful, but for too a 10 big. minute se segment, they are too large. I'm going to keep going with my concept so that way I can at least hopefully get a win. <laughs> If I can be victorious. I don't know, though. I really do like the concept of yours. I like the half tilas with the... So give us points for our concept as well when you we do get done with this time frame and you are voting. Yeah. Um, conceptual points are nice and awarded. They're like friendly points. Conceptual points because... <laughs> like when you could, can, can't do anything, then you get... You the, get the participation yeah, trophy. Yeah. yeah. You get a participation trophy. Just sad points. <laughs> 
No, but actually the, pity the points. points. The, the pity, pity points. There you go. Pity points. That's what you're working at. So I am. Let's see. I'm almost around mine, and I have 30 seconds left. So that's. Good I'm timing. making zips basically. Oh yeah, but you have. That's cool because then you're doing. I wasn't. I was expecting you to do more of a netting, not to do the peyote underneath. I always do I'm peyote. You That's your go-to stitching. Uh, I do yeah. because it's time. It's a time-based thing. Yeah, I don't netting care. you can do so. Yeah, I've got like the, like uh, the crystal path bracelet with the chatons in, inside. It was the first netting for me that like, you've ever done. Yeah, I'm stealing some of your beads because I'm out of eleven O's. and I'm bringing my netting around. And oh my goodness, one second left. Yeah. <laughs> All right, Oops. so. I pulled mine too tight. So again, conceptual points. So my idea was to get my, actually I could have done the netting the same size. My idea was to get the. This is, this was my conception. So I did this with the squares and it like, it looks like almost like I. So we kind of both have the same, right. we both have kind of the same struggle going on. Yeah. So. I actually, so I did a right angle weave and then did the bottom, or I could flip it over that I want to keep it more exposed at the top. And mm. yeah, see it raises, I know. I like the concept too. So I have the right angle weave going on that you can see the sides of the crystals and you could do the front or the back. It could actually I really like the tilas and quarter tilas for this. I do too. This. So I'm going to, I'm, I'm going to personally, I'm going to be the uh, sacrificial one that I actually like. Mm -hmm. the uh, Teresa's concept a lot. So I needed one more. I didn't get that even count. But yeah, so yeah, there's our like, there's our minds at work. It needs that's some kind of a tweaking, good it needs some tweaking, but that's our uh minds works. minds at work which ones you're going with. So yeah, fun stuff. Thank you guys. Thank you for that one. Da, 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 da. Now we have the leaf duo. Oh yeah. So it's such a pretty bead but so difficult to work with. I know, and actually what, okay, I'm still going back with this. I would throw up every other, yeah, yeah, every other teal, yeah. rather than doing peyote there, have the peyote with a half teal in the middle, throw up each one, and even though you would see less crystal, mm -hmm. it would look really pretty, or you could see bead to make it look like a flower. You could do like the four, I'm designing traces now, <laughs> I know, can't, can't stop. You know, you can, can make a video stop? from it. I could, I can make a video from Teresa's, from Teresa's design, or she could do it herself. All right, so we're you doing the next, we're I doing the know. next one. Yeah. All right, I'm gonna keep this, move it off the table, because we will have a final, we'll show you everything that we've done. So, I need another piece of thread. We're getting our needles ready. I never used the other crystal. I forgot about it. Yeah, you just uh, made a mess. It might stay. I did make a mess. I know. It might. You did too. Um, <laughs> but I so used. Don't blame me. I used you my used, stuff. You <laughs> used, you know, I'm out of. I'm out of seed beads already. I've used so many seed beads because I keep doing netting and rounding. All right, and we are doing paisley duos. We have or not paisley duos. No. Sorry, leaf duos. duos. Leaf duos. Are you keeping? You're you're thinking already about leaf duos and half duos. I saw you. No. <laughs> no, you're starting already. All right. Uh, oh, I'm putting on stopper beat. All right. I'm going to go in and get ready for our time to restart. And five, four, three, two, one. We are restarting now. So now, if you are joining us and you say, "What is this craziness going on?" That's a beat off. That is a beat off. So we are we are yeah, we doing like last a, hours together, and we need to make yeah fun. we need to. Uh, Reserve that yeah. the beat off. This is we, we, we are like being stressed for you because you will get the app in Christmas like All right, Ugh. so basically what we are going to be doing now is we take 10 minutes and in that 10 minutes We are going down the list that you see on the opposite side that way um, Of the today's design challenge palette. So for the design challenge the idea is that we take 10 minutes and we work with a bead and we see what we do with that bead and then we have a fun voting and we get to feel victorious for the day. And, and I'm like, throwing in some and, crystals. And throwing into in some the crystals. Game. Well you're throwing crystals in. Yeah. Alright. Um, oh, I'm stuck. I feel like mental mental blockage. So it's okay. Sometimes you get mental blockage with the different beads, yeah. and that's where we rely on you as uh, also fellow beater, fellow blah, blah, fellow beaters to oh, blah, 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 give us blah, blah, blah. suggestions. Um, I don't know. 
Uh, I don't know what to do. I'm looking at comments right here. You can probably see me. How do we reply to a comment during live? Um, you can reply to the comment of another person uh, to the you right, do, yeah. or actually we try to reply in it, but then we'll also kind of reply on the right-hand side. We're not going to type right now because um, we only have 10 minutes. Yes. So we'll come back to the comments after two, um, but we like to see what you guys are commenting because that helps us to design. Never try Leaf Duos. So every time I pick up Leaf Duos, they are so pretty. They're so pretty, and they're a little bit challenging to yeah. work with. We um, have we have some videos. There's the how do you call the one? The with garland, the garland, the garland, garland bracelet. bracelet. It's actually um, it will very be, holiday. It's yeah, perfect. very holiday. So yeah, you it's can, holly. Yeah, and there's like it's so many greenish, different colors and greens. Reddish. And, actually, we're kidding that. And you have a, you have garland bracelet with leaf duos, and I have floral garland necklace. I know, and they go really well together. Actually. Yeah, you could wear them together. And then, um, and I'm right. putting off my leaf duos. <laughs> I'm starting again. Starting again. Mm, you're pulling crystals in, but I think I'm gonna go organic. Organic, mm, just organic, with the leaves. Just with the leaves. And I'm gonna make sure as I pick up my leaves every other hole. I'm facing one leaf to the right, one yeah, leaf to the left, and I'm facing well, down and up. Yeah. So my leaf to the left, I'm facing so the tip is going down, the leaf to the right, the tip is going to the up. And then I might create some sort of a zigzag. Yeah, have fun explaining it like, when you're making the video. Yeah. <laughs> That's when I pull in two needles. When you can't explain how to do it with one, you just add another needle. And then you make everybody crazy because they're like, oh, I don't want to do it. Oh, man, and then I strung the left backwards. needle, and then it's the right needle. And then I already strung one of my leaves backwards. Uh, I'm not sure we have enough, like in the tube. We might. I know we might have to since they're big. I I only need. You are getting two up more. now. <laughs> probably yeah. It's my turn. I think I'm only going to need two more leaf duels. So oh, and they turned, and now I forget which one was which way. Uh, 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 what's my? What am I doing here? Come back to me, leaf duo. Having fun. having fun. I am having fun, but I can't figure out my leaf duos. Okay. Be being stressed and fun. It's being stressed thing. and fun. It's like adrenaline. And this is like, um, for those of you that are beating adrenaline junkies, you should challenge your friends yeah, to yeah. the design challenge and come up with, oh, crap. I had an extra seed bead. Ugh. All right. I'm going to say sugar. Oh, sugar. All right. Ooh. I'm getting caught up in the camera now. All right. I'm using Conceptually, this. my leaves are going in different directions, which is what I wanted. This one needs to come back that way. This one needs to go that way. I was thinking I'm going for like a zigzagging effect because of the way that they sit, but I need to make sure that my leaves stay. Mm. If only those went that way. That would be really not doing any more of the uh, yeah. conception of the organic. Let's throw in some Let's organic geometric. bling. All right, I need a bead there. I need to get up, I think. I need a bead. I have disc duos. Yeah, let me use some disc duos. I was feeling good with the disc duos. I'm going back to the disc duos. All right, I'm going to not waste my time on using any beads on the side because I need to get back to the middle. I'm making a huge bezel for a small crystal. <laughs> Well, that's at what, 18 millimeter that you have, Crystal? Uh, yeah. Yeah. All right. So this is fall. Oh, you're using distros too? Yeah. Oh, I, I didn't realize you were using distros. That's, that's why I stole that from you because I thought fine. you weren't. All right. I use something else. What do no, we got? Don't have to. Give me these round trios, faceted round trios. That's, this no, is like, that's normal. That's fine. Oh, first. that's okay. Whatever. That'll work. But the color is like. The color works well for fall. It's complimenting. It is complimenting. There's so many new comments. Yeah, oh, my goodness. We're. You I would do a multi-component necklace. necklace. Oh, yeah. Whoa. Oh. Maybe you can begin a couple of rows of 15. Sunflower idea. Thank Kathy, you. Kathy, yeah. Oh, the sunflower would look nice. Um, do, 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 do. All right. Are you getting inspired? Uh, I am. I'm seeing if anybody is giving me tips and hints and good ideas. So I thought this was going to be a round trio. So when I looked at it, that was going to no. give me uh -uh. a second hole to go with. Yeah. This sounds so funny, but now with the multi-hole beads, when I pick up a bead with one, with hole, one hole, I'm so like, boring. oh my goodness, I can't even figure out how to use this. <laughs> it only has one hole. What am I going to do with this? All right. Um, I can't pin it down or bezel around it. I can. It's just going to, I know it's going to kind of 
go. All right, but I'm liking this so far. Oh, I should bezel around. Mm, I'll come back if I have time, four minutes. All right. Mm -mm -mm. Can come back to it. I keep getting caught on the end. Come back to me. Oh, well, that's pretty. Thanks. I like the end. Of, I'm commenting on my own. <laughs> okay. I didn't look at yours. Yours is probably pretty too, but I'm focused on mine. Mine's pretty. It's that I'm not really sure what it was going to look like, but then you put it on and you're like, oh, it's prettier than I thought it was going to look. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, your colors look wonderful together. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Coming in here. Oh, I wanted to not sit curved. I would need an extra seat beat in there. Oh, I should have done something else. And now you have three minutes left to hang out and wish you did something else. Yeah, I should oh, have how just get put to the outside? directly oh. in again the leaf duos instead of the disc duo and close up the bezel. And then that would have gotten you already there. Okay, more challenge. More Taking challenge. it out. Taking it out. You're going to take the whole thing out? Yeah. Wow. But you can just picture... We, remember, we're getting conceptual points. Yeah. You can just picture that it's a leaf duo. Nah. I'm going to go for it. I'm, it's a different beat. You're different. going for it. I'm making a jumper, a jump here. That no, I need if you to thread the needle. <laughs> <laughs> See, if you would have, and Teresa said, I'm not threading any extra needles. I have one, and I'll just burn it off. Dumb. I, there you go. <laughs> I pre-threaded I pre -threaded four needles to get me ready to go in that short break that we took during the Q&A. All right, I'm still going in with this side effect here. I really needed about, some designs you can figure out the placement after like two inches. With this one, I probably needed about four inches to really be able to say yes to the concept because you have to get your spacing right. So this is more of a conceptual beading rather than an actual like super design time. Because what we do is we take the designs and then tweak them. So that way you don't have to, is we pre-measure exactly like how many seed beads are going in between just each. Just guessing. And yeah, and it's a guess. I'm not even using seed beads on the ends. I'm just kind of jumping. Um, I call them jumper yeah, you beads. you don't do that. I do that. I can't work. <laughs> yeah. I can't work without it. And I do and that it's jumping. Nice. Yeah, it's going well. I need more eights. So it's nice, but it needs more. It needs more detail. So I've got a minute, a little over a minute to add some more detail in here. I think I can do that. I have so one I'm more go minute to, to add outside. four more leaf duos. I know. One more minute, keep going. Do, 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 do. We should have like little noises that get faster. We should have like a little ticker yeah. that gets faster as we get closer like to the being the end. Like, the yeah. Chicken. Yeah. Chicken. <laughs> <laughs> you start like hyperventilating because it's not like ding, 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 Yeah. Getting faster and faster. All right. I am going to. We have so many great ideas. Yeah. We should. <laughs> They're all perfect. <laughs> They're all perfectly wonderful ideas. All right. Yeah, I'm not oh. going to toils anymore, which is doing yeah. this. Yeah, <laughs> we're just going to do, yeah, forget it. You don't get anything finished. You get weird concepts and just playing with beads. And a lot of mess on her beading. And a lot of mess, yeah. Oh, All right. 32 seconds. I'm not going to even uh, I'm I'm getting there. I got that concept in now. Yeah. And I, this is kind of fun because I hardly ever put 8 OC beads on my bead mat to play yeah. with. Yeah, me too. I um, don't like they're big. They are too big. They're so big. And I remember when I first started beading, and probably so many people can relate to this, I saw 15 O's and I was like, oh my goodness, wow, they're, the, I'm, I'm they're the smallest bead ever. They're terrible. It's so terrible to play with and work with them. And now I look at them and um, I think, oh, I need like a size 21 bead yeah. <laughs> before I go blind of, and get older. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm digging it. Actually, mine might even turn into a tutorial. Yeah. And I think what I would do is come back mm. and actually do the other side a little bit too. And when you have, time, oh, you next can... design. No, mm -hmm. no, 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 no. So I'm gonna lay mine down and talk to you about concept. I'll let Teresa. Um, I will just jump. I'll, I'll I will let just her. Step up. So what I would do with mine, if I had more time, is actually circle around the base of the leaf as well, probably in a different color and not with the 8Os, just with like the 15s. So that way the um, focus still stays on the leaf. So the idea that I have would be to go around the leaf with 15Os as well on the exterior, maybe even on the 
Yeah, maybe on the exterior point as well too. But on the interior, definitely add some 15 O's. Go back and do some more um, seed beads on the top over here. And if I switch to a round trio, yeah, um, yeah, yeah. then I actually mm. would have more options. Yeah, it would sit it further apart a little bit, and it would give me an opportunity to go back in there. So that's my concept. Is I didn't have ah, them, but I, just I would lost go my in. Really. And but my concept was a go super, ahead. A super explain huge, your a super huge bezel. Go which ahead. would fit just... like 25 millimeter cabochon. Yeah, but I like the small one in there because yeah, actually because you if you see... get, you can see the, yeah, I like the small cabinet. Maybe if like here mm. I use like just 15 nose. I think, I think it was worth it. Yeah. I think redoing it was worth it because I love that. Oh, that there you goes see mine. like see the two layers. Yeah. So what you could do, you don't do netting, but I'm going to teach you how to do some, <laughs> we're going to do some netting in the back. Hold that bezel exactly where it is so you can see the actual leaves. Yeah. So Teresa is going to do a tutorial because I vote Teresa as the winter, and I <laughs> am the, the one I'm the, as the winter. Um, I vote Teresa as the winner of this one, and um, she gets to be the winner because I get the final say. Yeah, I'm the one controlling the computer right now. So Teresa gets the win with that. You can, you can all be kind and give Teresa the win. She would love to see it again as well. Uh, yeah, they are magic apple. Um, that I was using yeah, yeah, yeah. and com oh, we could look at that. That was a great idea from Dina. And actually, Dina, if you didn't watch earlier, we answered one of your questions in the Facebook Q and A. That's a great idea. Ba -ba -da. Oh. oh, we just made a necklace. And Switch out your Rivoli for yeah, a magic drop. wand. Yeah. No, 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 no. Nothing else. It doesn't need drops. Yeah. And we'll keep that. All right. So we might have to do a. Here's how you make the chain. Bless you. So we're going to have to do a pendant and then I'll do the chain. So yeah. I actually think now that is a wonderful idea when you go and make it. So Dina, you win the, you win the award for the design. Yeah. Do, do, do. You win the design award. So look, I'm even going to like you in real time if I can. <laughs> oh, I thought I could. Yeah, we're going to like you in real time. Um, you win Thanks, the, guys. yes, the Astros lost. The Astros lost, she said. <laughs> the Astros lost, but you won number you didn't even have to design with the leaf duos and you won the prize for yeah, number yeah. three so keep in mind we are if you're joining this kind of crazy session we're having fun designing live um, on the spot we have 10 minutes for each bead and sometimes we grab other beads because we're bored with just one and we are designing for 10 minutes seeing what we get and then after that 10 minute period and kind of clean up the table. We get ready for our next, which we just finished the leaf duo. We'll show you at the end too, if you're just joining us, exactly what, what we made, made yeah, for yeah. all of them. Um, and, and now I need a new yeah. piece of thread. <laughs> so need a new piece of thread. I'm taking my thread burner, getting that. Um, there's actually, all of our lot of colors wildfire are going wild, into There is a lot of wildfire going in today's. I'm going to run out of thread, but I'm going to try it anyway. So we are going on to Eva next. And I never have enough time to do the Evas, and I am definitely using, as I go on here, I am definitely using these with the Evas, so you don't get to use those because oh. I already picked them. We have a very um, fall-themed color palette yeah. today. That was probably intentional. Oh. All right, so we have our Eva beads in our new color. This is a new Eva color copper um, that we just got in. Actually, we don't even have them in the States yet. Um, Teresa got them first showcase. because she lives way closer. Um, so they have to get over the sea uh, for us and we're getting them. The <laughs> so, oh, she can't thread the needle, so I automatically get a heads up because I'm going to start the clock quick. Watch, while she's trying to thread her needle, I'm going to start the clock. Look. Teresa, it's already started. You're wasting I'm time. Done. I'm See, done. because you thread your needle. All right. So we are doing the Eva bead. That's our deal to, right now is Eva My bead. My boss is bossy. My boss is bossy. All right. We're doing the Eva bead and, and a cheater. We're doing the Eva <laughs> bead. <laughs> we're doing the Eva bead and we are seeing what we can make in 10 minutes. And we appreciate your comments and your feedback to let us know exactly um, what to do because sometimes especially now we have done um, pretty much over the last three days we have done like, like 15, a lot of design, design time. each of us yeah even we've done a lot of design time so we appreciate your input too yeah. because that's fun well somebody did say to use uh, silkies, silkies. Or to, yeah so. thanks I guess <laughs> yeah to give the idea of the silkies because they get up 
So I'm starting out right away with these baguettes because I, I like the color. I think it's the khaki color is what these baguettes mm. are. Yeah. And I am getting, I'm getting a little um, hungry. Yeah. Luckily, I'm not getting hangry yet. I think that's, that's when it's not as much fun. All right. And we still need just that magical fairy to, once teleporting is available, we could, you guys could send us coffee. We could just appear in your living rooms and help you <laughs> to bead. It could be so much fun. All right. Um, we play just with, uh, yeah. clone ourselves. Love the tassel earrings. I think those are the ones that I'm wearing. Thank yeah, you. Yeah. Guess what? They are going to be a video for you. I actually just recorded it right before I left to come here. Um, I recorded these tassel earrings, so I think they get uploaded. Um, Anna, who is lucky and escaped um, this, next time I'm coming, or no, it's way more efficient to bring you to us than <laughs> multiples of us to you. Um, we'll force Anna to design, too. She'll come up and she'll be like, and I'll just have that happy little cloud right there. You can just put that happy little cloud right in that design. We'll be drinking gin and tonics and making beads. I can, and doing this I can design. some gin and tonic. Yeah. It's like my favorite. All right. And then, so I'm doing very, very simple concepts today. But that's okay because sometimes simplicity is good. We did use Eva's a little bit yeah. two days ago. Yeah. Is that two days ago? I don't know. All the time is running together. Yeah. Two days ago, I think. Two days ago, we used Eva's. All right. Oh, I strung mine backwards. No, I can do it that way. All right. Donna is watching from the hair salon. Mm -hmm. From the hair salon? Mm -hmm. Hair salon. It sounds like a good thing. I yeah, need to do yeah. that too. All right. So we are, what are we, how many minutes in? We're two and a half minutes in approximately. And the thing with the Eva bead is I think um, both of us are going to get designs out of this. I, yeah, I'm just. I, I feel like the Eva bead is such an easy flow. bead. <laughs> if you're not into um, being your own designer, I feel like the Eva bead is oh, such an easy. Good. Thanks. I'm still adding more seed beads. Mm -hmm. I'm a little seed bead happy today. And for some reason, I feel like I'm like bearded, and I keep like touching, <laughs> touching my beard. Like, hmm, if I would put this one here and then go to that hole. You right. need to touch your beard to be like. You I know, know. Wise. All right. And. Uh, uh, oh, it's not sitting up like I wanted it to. Well, I can play with that. I can get that concept to build in there. I want this to be three-dimensional. Mm -hmm. I really like my things to be multi-dimensional. That's where the multi-hold beads come in, that they're cool. Like I was saying earlier, I picked up those regular six-millimeter rounds, and it's like, oh, I can't get anything multi-dimensional <laughs> with that. All right. And that's not even a, like, that's just truth in my bead world. All right. So I've got some of my stitch going on. So this would keep going, but I think I also want to. So the baguette's a little bit longer than the Eva, which I really didn't think about doing a little bit of an issue with, but it's doing a little bit just, of an issue. Just I feel like it beads. needs, <laughs> I know, it needs a crystal in there too. More crystal. More crystal, bling it up, bling bling. I'm gonna add an Edo in there because that can take the place of a two millimeter crystal. This is a very weird right angle V stitch. How about some local mojitos? There you go. Mm. Sounds good. Teleport us there. Mm -hmm. All right. Or you could get your pumpkin spice latte. Oh, if you come to the, the States. Yeah. The fake pumpkin spice latte that doesn't have any pumpkin in it. I like the pumpkin spice beer. Pumpkin spice beer. Okay. And going back here. So, oh, see? Yeah, see, this is setting up like I wanted it to now. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. So we're getting them side by side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mine's getting a little bit more full than yours, which is what I wanted. So. I must say, like, those are weird colors together, but like the Eidos work with the Silkies and with the Eva, so it means that the Silkies needs to work with, with the, Eva the Eva's. Too. Yeah. The Silkies have a fun, the backlet looks really cool on the Silkies because it sits really nicely. Yeah, I just, the only thing with backlit, I don't like when there's like... One, yeah, that's, if you want to go and sit in the, uh, factory where yeah, no, they are coating them all and flip all the beads. No, I don't. That's for table cutting. That is, you see, you need to go on an actual tour of, yeah. you live here and you need to go on a tour. 
But they, um, for table cutting, for like our I, table cut buttons, yeah. somebody has to sit there and like turn them all and flatten them out. Mm. So everyone that says they're so expensive, you have no idea the amount of labor that goes into them. That's the cool thing about being here. Um, I had the opportunity to go to uh, one of the metal coating factories that we work with. Um, you get such an appreciation for things like in the U.S. I, you probably have never seen it. There's a show called How It's Made. Mm -hmm. I don't even know if it's on anymore. How it's I made. Don't know. Maybe it's really I've cool. I like it. to I like to watch it with the kids too. It go, yeah. You go through like different factories and it shows you how it's made. This is kind of like the how it's made for jewelry. Yeah, yeah. So how it's made, how we're putting it together. All right. So conceptually, I need to work on that inner section. What do we have? We have three. Well, okay, we have three minutes left. And my connection is poor. However, I know. I feel yeah, like I need, need to more seed beats in the. I need to. Top. I like what I've got going Ooh, on yes. for more lights. Certainly. More lights as the lights outside get darker. Yeah. Because we are actually here. Um, U.S. time we are 10:43 here. We are. <laughs> Dennis, I, I brows are back in. Yeah. Our, brows are, our brows are back in. Yeah, like. Um, those. I don't get it actually. I will say those. Painted like, on bigger ones? No, from the from the man I was like putting oh, on, yeah. like putting yeah. beads. But it, but in real fashion, in real life, I maybe I'm I don't think I'm cool enough to understand it. I guess. But those big eyebrows. Yeah. At least in the states, people are painting on big eyebrows and stuff. And yeah, I feel like it's uh, a, I'm not a fan. It's a weird trend. Yeah, and then there was like big lips too, and like there's few rules in makeup I remember, although I don't wear any and. Uh, don't use like big eyebrows, big eyes, and big lips. Big, just one thing. Just pick one thing. Well, big, it's big eyebrows in the States yeah. right now. I don't know why. All right, so I think my issue that I'm having and that I'm working on design wise, I like the 3D aspect. The issue that I'm having is I'm trying to do too many steps at once oh. because I'm trying to show you the finished idea rather than actually what's going on. And I'm not. Uh, I'm doing too many steps at once. So, how do you pick which one you like better? Oh, thanks. That's the nicest thing. All right. Um, so this yeah. works. That does. See, and, and then you have those happiness where she has the spacing exactly. So <laughs> Teresa's got the happy spacing. Because I got up and brought my beads. <laughs> you did. You got up and got your got your beads. You did self help. But um, you you told me like which kind I should yeah. bring. All right. I like mine, but it needs tweaking. I like my concept. I like how it's going a little bit 3D, but my beads in the center. I actually think, I don't know, I, I don't know if I'm dead set on the baguette anymore. I really wanted to use the baguette, yeah. but now That's that I'm using issue. it. Like, you really kinda, like something and you really want to use it, but it never like, I like these, but I don't, have, I don't have time to go back. Because you I want have the, a design already with this. I do. I did you, it the other you day. You did this See, two, year, two, two years, two days ago. I did do this two days ago. But I know I like they them. work together very well, but they do. you need to like step up your game. And I don't think I did it on screen, though, did I? I think yes, I you did. did. That. Oh, maybe it was I did. with the Evas. Yeah, but I think I did that when we were just sitting and playing. Uh, uh, maybe I did no, it on screen. No. I don't remember. I like the baguettes, though. Oh, we only have 50 seconds left. Okay. So This could be a video. Yeah, yours is totally done. So now Teresa gets to record this video after we get done with this. I think I need like some a bit a bit of relaxation. A bit of relaxation. This. I'm I kind of um, a supercharged person, so yeah, I, I like, think I'm exhausting to be around a little no. bit. A little bit no, exhausting. It's like it's on like oh, I did make you run. You didn't. I I didn't make Teresa run. Yeah. So. It was hard, but it's like I, I don't go every day that late to bed, and like I don't talk that much every day. I'm alone here the whole week. I okay. only I only interact with Pavel basically. Yeah. <laughs> so it's like too much talking. My my lips are sore, and like <laughs> I'm, had I'm actually, yeah, I'm actually <laughs> training for all those tutorials because I'm then sitting back in my office recording the videos, and I can't talk because you're not used to speaking yeah, because yeah, you're here by yourself. Yeah. Well, you're going to get to tune in more. So going back to my original design, now that it's not cluttered, I actually like it better. Oh, no, next yeah, design. Yeah. This is so much fun. This is so I know. Relaxing. When you get it to work, when you get this the idea so to work, fun. it's like 
that uh, so I will put mine here. So concept. All right. So I just need my last piece. This is so pretty. It is so pretty. And I would like add more, like another. <laughs> Because <laughs> you need it to be wider. Oh God, I like I like it simple, and I would keep it simple. Yeah. I actually like mine simple. Yeah, I, I try to crowd it up. I think yours is fine. Yeah, like, mine is but fine I feel too. Like but mine. Would, yeah, like, yours works perfectly with the. I would go around here one more time with sea beads. Yeah. And now you figured out the count for me. Yeah, it's eight. So it's eight. So it's I don't eight. need to think about that. I started that. with six and it's eight. Yeah. It's eight. So eight is the count. So mm -hmm. I'll go around eight at the top, and yeah. So you have. Teresa's design and my design, they're kind of similar, but we definitely went with uh, different different concepts. I yeah. feel like I need something different in there to kind of pull mm. that in and mm. that up, because I still want it to be a little bit three-dimensional. Maybe you should do some, wait, wait, there was, oh, no. Oh, here. Some beads sitting here. there? This is what I was like. Maybe I should do some sutash with it. There's like, oh yeah, you stuck the beads yeah, so it's because, sitting on top. Yeah, so it's sitting on it. It looks like a little little car, like yeah. a vehicle. Yeah, so beads. that's a good idea because you can run the thread behind yeah, so, and the obeads. And Denise yeah. said to use obeads, and I yeah. could have used obeads and set that up. That's a good. I think idea. you that, just need, actually like, that's first, a great yeah. that's a great idea. Yeah, because that would be perfect. That's to make like it sit the issue for me with set like shuttles. Things with settings. Yeah. yeah. So you need to good fun. support. Okay. And push them up. All right. So if <laughs> yeah, you are sure, enjoying me, us, Susan, like, oh, oh. sure. So if you, are, if you are just joining us, um, you get to see that what we are doing is we are doing a design it's live, a and we Looks are doing like a. No, we still have. We have storm duos. We have storm duo. We have storm duos to and do. And you should pick our last bead because it's like. I know the last bead is coming up, so you really need to help us pick the last bead, and then Nathan can run around and find that last bead for us so that way we can use it. Because we've already gone through disc duos, crystals and seed beads, leaf duos, Eva beads, and now we're on to storm duos. So we're gonna clean up our mat a little bit and get ready. The concept of this design challenge is that we have lightning rounds which are 10 minutes long. We get to play with one bead for 10 minutes or pull in a helper bead. And uh, playing with one bead for 10 minutes then, we get to design, create, and uh, show you uh, kind of where we are, what to do with beads, give you ideas hopefully, ask for your opinions and get your feedback because that's the best part about this is that we get to see kind of your feedback, your interaction. Yeah, so we are about to start storm duos. And for the storm duos, um, I was prepared. Yep, I still have one more needle. I'm good. Um, we have storm duos. Our bead mat is getting a little bit messy. Again, we'll pick somebody that gives us a suggestion. So if you're joining us, give us a suggestion exactly what bead you want us to use. You have about nine minutes probably for the viewer's choice to kind of flood it, decide what bead you want us to use. You only get to pick one, so don't pick two. So Kathy, you need to pick one. We're gonna pick one bead. We have beads everywhere already. Pick one bead. So redo it. So go back, pick one bead, and you have nine minutes to pick one bead, and then whoever votes, however many votes are the highest, you can jump onto each other's. You can like and reply to each other's comments if you want to do that as well, too. So, and we're gonna get back and start this video. So we are gonna restart, do, 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 restarting the timer, and we have storm duos that we are starting with. So, storm duos. Uh. All right. Um, so, let's see. We have storm duos sitting on the table. Therese is trying to tell Nathan where things are in the warehouse. And, um, all right, I have storm duos. We have storm duos in pink. So what are we doing with storm duos? Oh, we've got a lot of dagger. A lot of dagger things. Oh, pyramid oh beads. the pyramid beads. Pyramids mm, are good. Nice. Uh, all right. Um, mm, I have not picked up anything yet. <sighs> storm Where duos. Is Celsius. Oh my God. No. Storm duos. Storm duos. I'm going to keep going with this bag yeah, because it's here. Okay. And I just used the. Oh, I might use this too. I might change up my design. Oh, I'm bringing Eva's back in. I'm getting complicated now. I think. You're bringing this Eva's is where I need back a beat. Game. You know what would be nice right now? A beat up. To have the beat up. To have beat up. That I could do this without trying to have to do it, and I could do it so much faster without trying to actually 
put it right like this to figure out where my thread's gonna go. I think I'm gonna go for a component rather than a long design. I've been more successful with the components when they lead to the win. And actually, I had to pre-record the Better Beater episode, which will come out tomorrow. Check that out on YouTube. And the YouTube, actually it could be a bracelet. Um, the YouTube, it is cute. <laughs> the YouTube um, video tomorrow will be a new, new Better Beater. Uh, I have some Better Beater videos that is a series that I do on YouTube to give ideas, give suggestions, um, and help you to become a better beater. That's kind of the hashtag of it. Uh, and shows different techniques and tips and things you should know. And it's going to be on components tomorrow because I have components everywhere. Um, I do this a lot, actually, not um, on camera with Teresa, but I sit down a lot and I'll have basically allow myself about, so I've had practice, I feel like I've had practice doing this to some degree, not the pressure mm. of people watching right away, but I have about 10 minutes that I usually will pick a design and a bead that I will use and um, kind of see what I come up with. Sometimes they turn into designs, sometimes they turn into mistakes <laughs> that, that just get put, but a lot of times they definitely turn into a usable component and I have 12 million components that sit around and that I'm looking at. And uh, so I'm going to take that. those. Really? You don't have little little pieces of started projects everywhere? No. Really? Uh, we lead a different lifestyle. Yeah. I have little pieces everywhere of different components. I like so you to said finish eight, them. eight was my count? Eight is my count around the Eva? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I don't have to think about You're saving me some time of... Hey. I was going to try seven. Oh, actually, I am going to try seven because I want... One an 11 now. Yeah. yeah, on the top. Um, yeah, if I switch out the 15 for the 11, it might be a little bit tight, but it should work. Um, seven. All right, going in the other direction then. Yeah, I still would probably need more. Oh, it marks. All right, so I have my two beads on. I was. I started doing something, which was supposed to be <laughs> good job <laughs> tubular, and then it laid flat. Oh, that's cool. And it works. It does work. I mean, That's like cool. around three. See, would you be better. you can't get off of the disc duos. Yeah. Today is your disc duo day. Today is my disc duo oh, day. I have one CB there. I need one more. So I need to take this out here as I work on with it. And we still do. We still have uh, round trios. Donna Page said round trios. Oh, oh so you our finalists. All right. So now you've got to vote for the finalists because Nathan can't run around the warehouse at the last minute because he doesn't know where anything is. So we're going to limit him to the things that he knows and people have voted on. So we have obeads, pyramids, and round trios. So go ahead while Teresa and I are figuring this all out and vote. So your votes will be round trios, and they can be faceted or smooth, doesn't matter. Round trios, pyramids, and obeads are going to be our finalists. So everybody can see conceptually what's, what you're making and mine's like this mystery. It's all going to come together in the end. <laughs> I did get a really cute pair of earrings out of yesterday's design lab. I got more designs too, but the earrings I'm excited to actually go home and make the other one of. So I'm an earring person. I like earrings. Oh, that's a challenge. That's a challenge. We just got set nearest things that aren't, weren't, weren't finalists, but to use with the finalists, I think was the idea. Is that the idea of voice from behind? Yes. Yes. So we have <laughs> to go with, so this might affect what you're thinking. So again, we have obeds, pyramids, and round trios that look like they're going to be used with some cup chain. Yep. And maybe a round, round do a mini. mini. So we'll see what we get out of that. All right, I've got my storm duos in here. I'm gonna add another layer of storm duos. Should I add that now or after? Mine looks like a little door. What size pyramids? Oh, what size I, pyramids? Well, I only have the small ones, I think. So then small it is. Yeah, they are over there. <laughs> oh, pyramids, round trios, pyramids. Maybe we'll, maybe we'll do two. Maybe we'll challenge ourselves to do a number seven. Mm. If we have enough votes, we'll do a number seven. Are you sure you don't you want to go on the bus? <laughs> no, right? I don't want to get up, get back on. My children miss me. All right. Uh, 
one. Nathan's mother misses us too. She's probably done with the kids. All right, I mean. I like this. I need a bead. Um, what bead do I have? Do we have any three? Actually, there we go. I'll use a round duo mini. It's sitting here and it wasn't supposed to be used as part of this, but I just need a four millimeter bead. So I'm going to grab a mini. Mine I'm going to call um, the uh, something door. Door earrings. Dory. Door. Dorky. No, not dorky. Dorky's like a nerd. I know. That was yeah. a joke. Thanks. <laughs> at least Here once, I thought you at weren't being mean I, and it was no. just something lost in translation. No, you were just being mean to me. Thanks. <laughs> no, it's it's not dorky earrings. All right. I don't want to be mean to you. Oh, thanks. All right, go in here. Let's see. So mine is turning into a component. Like, this is the first thing. I really think What could you do with that? design. Yeah, what's earrings. it going? Earrings. You put, like, earring the thing here and a tassel here. Because it's not big enough already. No. <laughs> so throw in some Okay, extra. some brillo here. Some brillo there. No, I like the tassel idea. If you're going to go big, what do they say? Go yeah. big or go home? Yeah. Yeah. Go, big go Texas go style. Home. Go big or go home. Do we All have right. those little crystals here? We do have the little crystals here. They are in this little bag of little crystals. Mm. All right, I need to think about which way I'm putting my storm duo on. I'm putting these on the same right. way. Ah, I'm losing crystals. Losing crystals, don't lose I'm crystals. I'm disappearing and I'm going back up again. All right, so mine it might be a conceptual. You had to just picture what I was thinking, sort of a deal. I don't so know that do I'm going to get. Round trios. Pyramid, pyramid, pyramid. Oh my God. It's pyramid. Like Is pyramid the winner? Yeah, I think. All right. Uh, yeah, it's a giant snowflake. I think so too. All right. Oh, now oh, I'm now thinking what about going this way with it and connecting it with the round tree on minis. No, I still like it this way. I've just got to pop that in there. Pop. All right. Mine is the concept is is building. Building, building. All right, we have one and a half minutes left to see my concept. Yeah, I'm just like, it reminds me of something. <laughs> it reminds me of a Pegasus horse. It looks like yeah. horse wings. I like the, like. Like the stern duo like this. Yeah, it does. It looks like wings. Yeah. And then the question is, so once I get that bezel set in there, because it fits perfectly in there, do I repeat and or do I connect the outer edge? Do we go fancy with the tassels? And you should put tassel? like a bigger bead here and then turn the other way and, and put do this another one? again. Yeah. Yeah, I'd have to grab more materials. And we have 55 seconds. I'm never going to get there with my more materials. So, all right. I could do an earring or a pendant. You go up the That deco. you could do that. I am going a little art deco. So for this design here, I'm going a little bit art deco. I'm not big on that there. I'm like, I don't know. I'm like I think, surprised. I think actually what I, like, I think what I would do actually is take these and, and now this hole is curve stuck. them in. So remember, like we say in each video, check Make your sure. house. Yeah. I don't have the time for this now. Yeah. All right. Um, uh, Looking. I'm done, I guess. So, 10 seconds. Oh, yeah. we're done. Yeah. So, so, this was the idea. This is the concept <laughs> here. I'm stuck here. And I'm going to repeat mine, I think, this is with. This pretty. Um, a, mine so actually might turn into a pendant. Yeah. But I could do the Eva's coming out that mm. way, too. I don't know. I'm going to play with mine. This is one of those I had said before. What I do with them is generally. I could, it could be a butterfly. Butterfly. Yeah. Oh, yeah, if I turn the other way. It looks That's like a good, the moth. Yeah. Well, moths, moths don't have a good, but a, a they pretty are like, concept like, in the U.S. They can be really pretty, I, but it, people think I like I need you, to. I but I have a moth collection at home. All kinds of weird things yeah. I'm learning. So yesterday Nathan ate ants, and <laughs> Teresa has a moth collection. So we've got they all kinds pretty, of weird things. Yeah, so repeat the pink, and then another big section. Yeah, I think that's what yeah. I would do: is repeat yeah. the pinks. You could, we could combine them too. That would be a lot of effort. Um, 
So, Teresa, you were the only one that got mentioned by name. So I think Eva mm. picked you as the winner. That Thank Teresa, you. yours, yours automatically won. Oh, but Katie likes mine. Da, 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 da. Uh, or Kathy, sorry. All right, so going in here. Um, mine we are, has, mine so, has angry face in the middle. Anger face. Yeah, uh, Denise sees anger face in the middle. Oh, I see a little uh, bit of that. Yeah, yeah, like it's more of like an angry. Um, it's more of a uh, angry lion. Yeah. Or some, yeah. Yes, it's like an angry yeah. lion. Yeah. It's like <laughs> it's like turn our head to the yeah. side. Oh, yeah. It's How like about egg, that angry, angry lion? dinosaur with all those yeah. things on this. All right. So going in now, we have completed. All right. We'll show you actually because we need to think about. Um, Can I get a beating foundation? We. We, for what? What are you beating? Foundation. For the pyramids. And for, for the, the pyramids. And, sure. And the, the sure. Chain. So I will show off as you get the, the beating foundations. Okay. Actually, we'll show them off at the end because then we can yeah, see yeah, yeah. and explain Just because some of them need the conceptual explanation. Teresa has left the building again. She's, <laughs> she's leaving again. She's getting beating foundation, which makes me a little bit intimidated because... Um, I am not going to be using a beading foundation. We are starting, I think, what won? I think actu the, actual, mm, the actual winner was probably, uh, I don't, actually it's pretty close between pyramids. I think pyramids were the actual, pyramids and round trios. So we're gonna start with pyramids. What are you cutting? Beading foundation. She's got all kinds of, she's gonna make this beautiful. She's got crystals out. You want the gold pyramids, don't you? Do you want gold sure, or silver? I don't, I don't care. I don't really care. All right, here, let's change it up. Hand me some foundation. Okay. Let's change this up. I don't do uh, bead embroidery very often, so I don't know. Well, I need the scissors, too. Let's see. It will be quick. <laughs> I'm going even smaller. My beading foundation is going to be even tinier. So when and should it's not we start? Squared. I think we should start the timer. So you're going to... I'm usually ahead of you, yeah. so you get I'll to start the timer. Huh. I'm not sure we have here the right pliers for cutting, cutting the cup chain, though. Oh, you can... Okay. This is another... Uh, some people are going to cringe. You can just cut the cup chain with the scissors. Yeah, okay. It's going to hurt my scissors, but I'll still give you... No, these are like... We can use these. These are... All right, I need some thread here. There's a whole bunch of thread over here. I'm going to okay, thread so on the Okay, so I'm restarting the... You're restarting the timer, and we're doing beading foundation. So, the beading foundation, if you're unfamiliar we with beading think. foundation... We are doing pyramids, and the pyramids are a six millimeter pyramid. We are doing beading foundation, which means that we are going to be doing bead embroidery. So the foundation itself is usually for bead embroidery. Oh, I've got thread in my needle. Your needles usually have about a four project um, lifespan. So I'm going, your, your beading foundation is bigger than mine, but I'm going to actually, so I don't have to actually sew through and stop it and tie knots. I'm just going to do a stop bead on the bottom of my foundation. And then I don't have to worry about it. So now you get to just sit by the fire and watch us sew for a little bit. So. Now you use big beads. It doesn't take so long. It doesn't take, doesn't so take long. a long time. All right. I'm going to use crystal. Because oh, <laughs> I'm going to use crystals because then it's taking up more space. So we're using beading foundation, which means we're sewing on. I'm to using both colors. Using both colors of what? Oh, you're doing both colors of pyramids. Yeah, that'll look cool. And the beading foundation is basically a stiff piece felt. of felt. Right. Yep. Yeah. So yeah. it's a starched piece of felt, and you can either get it in black, you can get it in white. Um, you can color it with a permanent marker. Do you know Nicole's bead baking? That you can get a different yeah, colors. Yeah. yeah. I use, I, well, it, it's difficult to get something like this in Czech Republic. Well, it was, now we are here. Yeah. <laughs> now you're here. Yeah. So. so then what we would need to do is after the sewing, the problem with us sewing is that I know we're going to constantly have to bring it back down because it's right by our faces yeah. and you can't see as much. With the sewing, you have to bring it up to your face and see what you're making yeah. and where your needle's you need coming out You need to get up with your needle need right to, next to the to bead, be so you need to like check it constantly. I know. And the OCD in me strikes again because and I didn't start to. in the middle. Why would you start in the middle? You don't need to start in the middle. I do. Just cut your foundation then. No. I know. Yes, That's okay. Just a tiny little bit. All right, I'm going for seed beads. 
first because I'm realizing that I can't take forever to do this. So I am going to... All of them at once. I'm doing all of them at once. I know. It's like the no-no. I can go back and pull them down yeah. later. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to cheat halfway and go up. And I'm really, cringing. She's cringing. Uh, she sees. This is why we didn't do our sutash. I'm gonna. I'm cheating. Just coming down with half of them to kind of pull them in a little bit. I will need to go. You'll get, you'll to, get the concept. To Maryland, and we just will put this on for six hours and just beat away. Yeah. All right. I need to break one of my beads off. Every design is just like part of it. Break one off. It's stuck under there. All right. So, yeah, my foundation, I have not used pyramids yet. I should have not done foundation. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so much quicker Look, with copy than foundation. Where's the, where's the thing? I could have sewn four together way faster than that, though. We could have a sew-off. You could use foundation, and I could have just um, done them. So the reason that I would use foundation versus not is if I want to get something on an angle that's not going to actually sit normally like it would. That's why I tend to pick up foundation if I do, which I don't honestly very often. Um, I've done earrings with it and I would suggest a pendant first rather than earrings because you have to get two that match for the earrings. And that's a problem when you're first starting out. All right, so I'm gonna sew down my pyramid on an angle. Oh, you've got cup chain in there. Look at you getting fancy. You're going uh, like a rocker, steampunk. No, it's art deco. Art deco. I oh, you're doing the art deco now? Yeah. You're the art deco one It's like now. simple and whatever, but art deco is not simple. <laughs> art deco is not simple at all. Yeah. So I have mine going like that. And I'm going to come up the other side so here. So this is like answering the question from Q&A Live. <laughs> yeah, actually, how do you attach yeah, the cup chain? The cup chain. Watch the video Watch if you want video. to know more on our YouTube. Which it will just be live. Out. It actually probably is live it's already. It's already live, I think. It's, it's already live because it's past 9 o'clock. Yeah. So how's yours going so far? I think I'm fine. Trace is a way faster sewer on mine. On mine. On than I am. Oh, mine's crooked. Look, exactly like four of them are... Four cups are four. Yeah. Oh, like four cups are at the side. The side. Of the, oh, that speaks to me so much. <laughs> it's perfect measurement. Yeah. I can't get my, this is, my beating foundation's wonky. I'm in the zone now. <laughs> She's in the zone. She's got five minutes left. I'm a little wonky. Um, let's see. All right. Mm, what could I add here to make this correct? I can come back through here. How can I bring my needle to pull it to the correct spot? I think I made a boo-boo. So, I just realized, you know, it's a square. How are you going you to turn the cup? <laughs> you can. Well, now you're going to have to cut it. Yeah. You can use my scissors. Yeah. I'll forgive you. It's okay. I will try to use these. So I will have to start from, like, again. Cool. I will try to cut See. the thread. It's not perfect, but it works. Yeah. All right, That's there. Fine. I pulled mine down a little bit. So now I'm going to go back in with my pyramid. This is kind of not really using a ton of pyramids. That's the thing with bead embroidery. You at least used yeah. four. I'm not even, which I feel like yours could go on the bottom of mine that we could piece these together too as we're looking at them. So I'm going back here. Oh, Kenner, do you still put on the projective layer when the work is finished? You do. So yes, you are still going to put on the um, like the protective. actual backing? Yeah, you'll put the backing on. Because basically what the backing does, especially like mine, it has terrible the... thread lines. Yeah. So it's not going to um, see. Actually, it would be fun for everyone to like post a picture of what the back of your thread lines looks like. Yeah. Um, so you so... can use various materials for the like actual backing. Now we have on both sides, finally, the artificial leather in many colors, and I like the gold and the camel gold. I think I named that one. It's yeah. super cool. It doesn't stand out, but it has some, like, blink to it, and it's, like, special. We can use ultra suede or, like... Say it again. Ultra? Ultra. 
Ultra. Ultra. Ultra. Yeah. Like, You're good. Uh, but I just like the, the way it just sounds pretty when you say yeah. it. Ultra. You know, we say it Schwedka because Ultra is it's like, it, it, it's like Sweden to us. And Sweden is Schwedka. So we call it Schwedka, like the Swedish Sh- woman. Swedish woman. Yeah. Like Ultra Suede for me is Schwedka. Like Swedish. Yeah, like, I have, I like until you said that I had no idea how to pronounce suede. <laughs> suede. Yeah, that's a hard one. Most people in the yeah. U.S., um, if you ask them to spell suede, yeah. couldn't do it. Yeah. I probably until I started making jewelry couldn't spell suede. I know. Technology how to write, and but... spelling are not my thing. Spell check is not always correct. You have to know at least semi how to spell it before you yeah. can actually smell. And after we're done this too, we're doing the pyramids right now. After we're done this, we are, so the pyramids for those of you just joining in that you have no idea what we're doing, That's we did a 10 minute um, challenge that we did different beads with thread and needles. And now the viewer's choice, we've thrown a curve ball in and we are using beading foundation in addition to our pyramid beads. Um, to get them, uh, yeah, we're using beading foundation, showing a different technique, to which I am much slower at. So oh. I feel like Teresa has the advantage here, and I have to go back. If you would ever see, if you would ever see the back of my um, simple bead embroidery pieces, I have to go back and actually like pin my beads down because I don't leave enough space for them and do enough. It's not very, but. Not the uh, most appropriate, or not appropriate, that's not the right word, um, professional looking. So I definitely always back my work because it looks terrible without being backed. So the backing actually hides if you have to do a lot of thread. The cool thing with bead embroidery though, especially if you're doing like a cuff, a cuff is a good thing to start out with or a pendant. There's no right or wrong. It's just kind of like, mm, just keep adding beads. You can add beads to it. Uh, mine is starting to look it's like some sort of It's not working out at all for me. <laughs> Yours looks really pretty though. It's like almost perfection. Yeah, but it should have been like only like four. But why can't you do four, four, and then five on the other? Like you can do uh, but the length tall and high. But now I don't know if high. I should like put here, I guess, another. It's like, it's not geometrical. It's not in line and I'm suffering. It's, yeah. So we have, oh my goodness, we only have 24 seconds left. Oh, uh, oops. <laughs> oh. So yeah, so we're not looking at all um, at our time my clock. Bruce Way shoes. Yeah. Yeah. All right, so my concept was I was doing more seed beads and Coming then I'm going to do more face. again. And I get the difference, I get the difference. All right, I'm putting my bead embroidery aside Yeah, I'm because done. that was a pyramid failure. So in order to redeem ourselves, let's give a couple more minutes where we're going to start Another the clock one. again. Oh. Just a couple more seconds here, ready? We're going to start again. We're not even really ready, but I'm going to start the clock again because I feel like we failed you. <laughs> I feel like we failed you on the pyramids. So we're going to do the pyramids. I feel like a failure. But I feel like I failed on the pyramids because I used one and I used it poorly with the backing. So I'm going to put on here the round trios and the pyramids. I'm I've got my like, needle ready to go. This is a good go. idea. I'll like maybe play. Maybe yeah, play with yours. Yeah. Not me. <laughs> I'm going to burn my thread off my backing. And... And All right. doing I'm playing. I'm playing trios. just for a couple of minutes with round trios. Um, um, yeah. So I, round trios I'm and pyramids. Because what are we on? We may baguette. miss our bus to the airport. But no. We're still good. enough time. Yet. We're still good. Um, so and then we'll have to stay with Teresa forever. So yeah, cool. okay. So we have our eleven. Oh, I'm gonna do my bead stop. And I'm using pyramids and trios because actually they're really cute just right next to one another. Like you really wouldn't yeah, even have to do anything. Yeah. I mean, it, when you look at them, it's such a cute bracelet. Just put like a demi round in between each. Yeah. And then you yeah, get yeah. A, a wrap bracelet. Yes. Yeah, so stretchy, simple. Stretchy bracelet. Yeah. All right. I'm going to see about doing my concept here. I need to have a concept in mind for this before I start on it. Because my last bead embroidery did not work very well. So if I have a concept in mind, that's going to be better than not. Cool. It's getting there. But the question is, I don't, I want it to stay cubed. So I need to figure out how I'm going from, Mm -hmm. or squared. I don't want it to Mm -hmm. go down the sides. 
Um, although I could just make a checkerboard. Yeah. That I could do the round trio like here because they're the same size. Yeah. See, that would take no, no, that'd be fun because you wouldn't need to do anything. You don't even need, I'm done. <laughs> I don't need to, don't even I'm need to string here. it. Done. Oh, yeah, I somebody else said checkerboard. Yeah. yeah. So, but I'm going to remove it. I'll keep going. Rather than being done, I will go with this concept. So, pulling in these pyramids. I'm not going to put seed beads in between, but I feel like it's, I'm going to regret that. I feel like I'm a bad streamer because you keep describing what you're doing. I do, I know. You need like, to work on your description game here. Yeah, but at uh, the English same time... Is, um, English is also my first language, so yeah, it's a little bit easier for me. Yeah, but like... I think I was You're to talking, talk. and to I talk. can't talk like over you. <laughs> That's not because you're a bad streamer. It's because I do all the talking. All right. Um, it happens a lot with my friends. I just sit and listen and they talk. I'm just taking it all in. Yeah, I'm the, I'm the listener. Right. I'm the listener in this game. Oh, oh, I, must drop I like this. Well, that is pretty. Just, yeah. just this. Nice and simple. Actually, these pyramids are being um, quite productive. Yeah. The pyramids and the round trios, actually. You good guys, choice, guys. Yeah, good choice. Good choice because they fit together kind of perfectly. And they, look, it's like bending like a bit. Perfect. Like it's going to be a perfect Perm bangle. Yep. Yeah. Bangle bracelet, all right. Mm, got these bangle, on here. Bangle bucket bracelet. Bangle bracelet. Bangle baguette. Right. The hardest thing, honestly, for me, is naming the pieces naming of the jewelry. Stuff. The what? naming the stuff is so hard because, especially when you get to the point, and then remembering the names after that um, is really, really hard as well. Because you get to a point where it's like, I don't have any more names in my head. Um, mm, 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 mm. All right. So How do I end the round trios to this? Um, you just switch the pyramids for the round trios. You can tell people that conceptually you need to move it over here more so people can see. Yeah. Six millimeter. So I like the pyramids with it. You have, it's okay, I'm using the round trios. If you don't want to use the I would pyramids, like to like we'll build give you it up. I'll see. It's I'm gonna see. So I'm just doing square stitch and square stitching my pyramids together on the sides here. And sometimes when we do designs like this, they turn into something else, and you realize there was a way easier way yeah. to do this. Every single time. That's how I'm. I often look back at pieces and think, yeah. Oh my goodness, why didn't I do it's this? It's like uh, when I did when I did this thing. Each one is different. Each one of those is different. And the last because one is like, the one recorded. <laughs> because you're like, yeah, yeah, that's the way to do yeah, it. Yeah, it's like when I, like, how to reduce the amount of, like, when you go through the... And I feel like ends, knows. yeah. And endings, I feel like you, yeah. the first time you do it on every design, it's like, oh, how am I going to do yeah. this? Where do I come out yeah. with? And it gets easier and easier. So... Do, 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 do. All right, let's see. How are we doing I here? Should, we, have, have, we have five minutes left. We should have continued. And then we really do sleep. need to go because yeah. we, need to, we need to literally go. Yeah. Um, that's a sad thing with the end of today's. That's why we decided to do it one more time because we're having so much fun doing this. I need to figure out uh, how I'm connecting these sides then. I've got my extra piece. So had I done this as I was stringing them, it would have been way easier. I should have continued in one more bucket. One more. <laughs> so I will just, I will just continue. I All will right. push the 15 so you can see the how back. You're, oh, you're putting them on two to square. I like that. I like the every other, actually. Doing like three. Let me bring mm. those over so you can see a little bit more. Three, and then one, and then three, and then one. So, yeah. This one doesn't have a hole. <laughs> actually, no, I need to move over. All right. Yeah. Um, <laughs> I need one more silver. Uh, I'm reaching. All right, I, so I don't have time, well, no, I have time to do one more. Eh, maybe not. All right, I'm going to go and do, coming out of here, see, I don't, my thing is, I don't want to connect to those two outer holes, I want to keep it, like, really simple. So to do that, I'm going to have to see about going into here. And I would if I was doing this again and had more time. 
I totally would add more uh, add a seed bead between each. Yeah. So now, oh, I could crisscross. That's what I could do. Let's see if that works. It might not work with anything other than 15s. Mm -mm. Concentrating hard on this one. Yeah. Like this is our like chance for redemption. <laughs> <laughs> That's I don't think it was that bad. No, I feel defeated by the beading foundation though. Because I did, I, it's just you it's one of those techniques you it. can't really you just can't do it really quickly. That's the problem. It's not a quick you saw my stuff. I do sutash. Yeah. So I do cross stitch with beads. <laughs> we'll see if you still do all of those longer uh, crafts once you have kids. <laughs> Somehow there aren't as many hours but in the day. You see me. I don't do anything or complicate it. <laughs> with more beads. Let's see. Go big or go home. So go big or go home. Yeah. I go home. <laughs> oh, I need more 15s. You got them. Right. You used all Six. of your stuff. I'm like, I did. I've been using a lot of seed beads. All right. So my concept is getting there. I'm, I'm crisscrossing between. That's mm -hmm. connecting my holes. Mm -hmm. I still don't know yet how I'm going to get from the top. I'll probably bring it down into a V. Yours. The colors of that look really pretty. Yeah. The colors work I'm super super like well. This one, like the seed beads, this is not like the best, but the rest is like No, I think that makes it pretty. It's yeah. like, uh, yeah. Or I really maybe, like that one. Maybe without the gold on the sides because it's like well, super, yeah, without super the gold extra. On the sides. Yeah. But I like that. I think the colors of the peach with the champagne are, are definitely yeah. good. Wow. All right. Let's see here. This is cool. That is cool. That's a winner. Ding, 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 ding. No, I like it open. I like it open. I actually, and this is the simple versus the like, I like the single down the line, down the middle. Better. That's just me. I just like building up, building it up. And keep going. It's like just Lego. keep going. Uh -huh. Yeah, it is like Legos. And that's, I think, important for people that are watching to realize is basically it is like Legos. We have one minute left to finish uh. up here. And this will give me a chance to kind of see how I'm getting from my top to my middle here, coming down. So now that I see this, I would do this in rows. That would go from top to bottom. And so what do you think? Are you still thinking three? Three wide? Yeah. Yeah. Maybe each like each other when like when you said that it's like working. Yeah. Let's see. I have three more beads to add. Twenty two seconds. No, that's even wrong. We have less than that. All right. I'm almost finished this. All right. I just want all right. To I at least got one. Tables. I at least got one side of mine done. I didn't get to connect the upper side to the other side. But uh, next design. We are actually not going to have time for the next design. So, yeah. So we need to show everybody what we did. Yeah. Yeah. So they need to vote, like, for this one first or not? Um, yeah. So which one? We have lots of concepts going yeah, with yeah. not enough time to finish them. So we've got Teresa's, which actually yours would look really pretty as a pendant. I was thinking of yeah. a bracelet, but it looks really pretty as mm -hmm. like a diamond pendant. Mm -hmm. You could do the sides with just more, like get more of that diamond in, do it one more wide or something. And then mine is yeah. definitely was going to be a bracelet. I didn't get the seed beads in and a chance to connect to the next row, but it kind of gives that, uh, we could call oh. this like the great, the great pyramid design yeah. <laughs> that we have the left and right. So we got to chant place to, mine does look like a dragonfly. I'm on like, yeah. I'm on like animals today. I just need some wings. Do, 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 do. <laughs> there you go. Wait. I don't have another one. Oh, there, there you go. <laughs> go big, go big, oh my go home. We actually have dragonflies that size yeah. pretty regularly. Yeah. Um, so. so anyway, we are going to show you what we did. So this was design number 
seven. seven. Yeah, seven. So we, we added one on the bottom. Again. So we, if you are joining us live, you can go back and watch this. We actually were live right before this, doing the Q and A for today, showing you a sneak peek at sneak peek at the beating apps. Um, and yeah, so number one, what did we play with first? Disc duos. This so, was this yeah. For me. So the disc duos for me were this. And then I was going to put other disc duos between and some crystals. So there was our disc duo. That was number one. Then we went to number two was our crystals and seed beads. By the way, I think I won this one. I think you won that one too. I oh, know. We had to rub it in. So then crystals and seed beads were next. Yeah, this was And so netting so versus peyote. There's my dragonfly wing. We're missing one. Yeah. Oh, see? I needed both of those wings for my dragonfly. Yeah, yeah. You there used you go. yours. You could put yours on my dragonfly. And then we can create a whole new design. So number two <laughs> is our dragonfly wings made with our crystals and seed beads. And we played around with the, um, the navette there in yeah. the crystal. Number three was our leaf duo. So, number three, we actually um, decided that we probably need to do this together. Yeah. Is that we have the chain and we have the crystal as well. That so that was a our, leaf duos. that's a lot of leaf duos. But we could stop here and continue yeah. up with yeah, the actual simple. rounds. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, so we have leaf duos that we had our pendant and our chain for our leaf duos. Then we did, what did we do? Ava beads. Where's Eva Eva beads. Oh yeah, we did Eva's, sorry, Eva's, Eva's. I'm just as yeah. bad as everyone else. All right, who named those beads so close? All right, <laughs> and going back here. This was mine, I gotta shove my crystal in because I never Are got it sure? in. Are you sure? Isn't it this or this, the storm duo thing? Oh, did I do, yeah, sorry. I did the same stuff. I got, got in a trap with crystals. Hey. So yeah, that was that one. Yours worked out perfectly. Mine needs some working. And we worked with the baguettes and those. Then we did storm duos. Ooh. And I kept with my storm duos. I kept what? going with my Eva my, beads. My angry lion. And your angry lion that we did with the storm duos and my pegasus wings or my butterfly wings. Then for number six... What was that? That yeah, was our viewer's choice that yeah, we, choice. we tried to do something too quick with backing, which is really slow, and we probably needed an hour to actually go through. That's the wonderful you thing a, of, like, think about, bolt. like, top designer or what is it called? Um, uh, Sherry Serafini? No. <laughs> no, top designer, yes. But the, the um, where they do uh, Tim Gunn, and it's like... Just do it. Get to work. Just do a little bit of work. What's it? What's that American uh, design show called? Oh, I have top, no yeah, top, not top designer. What's it called? Somebody's gonna help me out and comment. Um, yeah, but they have like 24 hours and they make it into an hour show. Okay. So they just cut clips and it's like, yeah, had we had 24 hours, we probably could have made yeah, something sure. nice it's out no of problem. that. Yeah. So somebody, somebody gave me that. Oh, nobody even commented yet on what that. Show with Tim Gunnis. Come on, people. Um, and then our no six, is. six is, um, were they like great seven. fashion designs? Seven. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was yeah, six. Seven. This and then seven, seven was the one that we just dragonfly. finished. And my dragonfly that I didn't finish yet, too. So that was number seven. So we had fun today. And again, we will pick a winner. So if you want to comment on this, yep. um, go ahead and comment. Project Runway. Thank you, Carrie. You win the prize. Oh, wait. Somebody else beat you to it. Uh, yeah. yeah. Sorry, Joan beat you to it. Kara, I gave you credit, but Joan actually won the typing contest. She typed faster than you did. Um, but yeah, Project Runway. So now you're going to have to watch The Sound of Music and some episodes of Project Runway. My I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to tell you. Um, Are you going to write me a list? Yeah. Right, I'll write you a list of the good shows. Oh. So we have um, a super messy bead mat that we will again be passing off the contents of a bead mat to a winner. We didn't pick one from the last one because we forgot. We have the bag of beads. So what we're just going to do yeah. is between these two um, design challenges yesterday and today, we'll pick one winner and send load, the beads. send you all of these, these goodies. So we'll pick somebody right before we leave. Um, that way we figure out whether or not it's best to stay here or whether or not I take it back to the States and ship it. So we'll do that as well. Keep in mind you um, have probably tons and tons of content that you can watch from us from the last two days. Yeah. With these Facebook Lives, you can go back to um, the previous Lives and actually watch. I did put in the comments of the last Q&A to, to really check out that beating app. We're really looking for feedback, so if you can comment. I know you didn't get a chance to play with it, um, but Pavel did an awesome job doing the demonstration, and if you can get a chance to give us some feedback 
on the actual beating app and let us know um, what you really think is essential, what you think um, you would like to see or what you are dreaming to see. They can be things that we can say to you, that's not possible. Um, but dream big and let us know what you're thinking of about the beating app. Give us a lot of um, ideas, suggestions, inspiration for that, and a name if you want to help us name the beating yeah, app yeah. as well. And yeah, and we're going to try to do this again to uh, figuring out some technical things um, as far as a chance to get us both back in the same screen, although we'll be Not in too, separate, separate places, uh, mm -hmm. but in the same screen as well. So we are signing off for you guys. We've got to, um, I have to get to the airport and uh, we've got to clean up all this stuff and we've got a bunch of other stuff to do in about 30 minutes. So yeah, <laughs> so we're gonna get time for that. Thanks so much for watching and tuning hopefully you enjoy and tuning in and watching these lightning rounds of the design challenge. And until next time, um, I don't know, I think between yesterday you won, today it was kind of a draw. I don't know. Yeah. yeah, I think we had a draw today. Yeah. So you can comment who you overall thought was um, the winner and uh, who who won today's challenge. Teresa definitely won yesterday. I'll give her that. Um, so I'll I'll try to to win one of one of these days. I'll practice on my uh, Sutesh skills as well, so we can have a Sutesh off Sutesh off Sutesh. challenge. Yeah. So thanks so much for watching and have a good rest of your morning, lunch evening, Dang. day, wherever you may be. Oh yeah, it's Friday too. Yeah. Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy your weekend. Thanks for watching.